genius, but he will need it as the welterweight champion of the world, the Hellraiser Jeff Hale from Tulsa, Oklahoma, steps into the middleweight division for the second time. Only 73 kilograms, this man is one of the most versatile and complete arm wrestlers the sport has ever seen. Both men in black, both men on home ground. And take that car off, Jeff, please. The man in the glasses is the reigning off. welterweight champion of the world, the... the Hellraiser, Jeff Hale. Centers Watch this the way. speed from, hit from Ethan Fritchie. Look He's got an incredible hit, incredible off. drive. Move there. Could be the there. difference at middleweight, and it is an enormous yeah. hit. That's a win. Hale is on the running foul, but it's of no consequence. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Yep. Venomous start from Ethan Fritchie. You do wonder whether it was a wise decision by Jeff Hale to step to the middleweight division, but he wanted a test. He wanted to show that yeah. skill can beat power. Right, look, and get hold him, hold him time after time. He's not gonna hold. It's gonna wear me out. Are you serious? <laughs> yeah, okay. Man, you got the hit. That was strong. That was stout. That's where he's going every single time. It's no surprise. Yeah. He's got to dive in right there. <laughs> a little difference of opinion in Ethan Fritchie's hey, camp. Don Fritchie saying, hold him, wear this guy out. The gamer, who's the man actually pulling at the table, said, I can't hold this man. Are you kidding? That'll wear me out. Shoulder. Fritchie leads one pin to nothing. The Hellraiser. Don't move there. Jeff Hale. Go! Wow! Huge no, hit from no, the Hellraiser. We are no, deep inside. No, not now. No, no. Wait till he does it again. We separate drop side. Wait, wait till he hits the drop side. Wait, he's already. Drive, <laughs> drive, drive. Drive, baby, drive. Drive. I'm waiting. Yep, tell him who your daddy is. Sit down and wait. Look at him. Tell him who his daddy is. Tell him. Tell him, Ethan. It's a second foul for Jeff Hale, a phenomenal war. But the ominous sign for Ethan Fritchie is that damage done could make all the difference. And an aggressive, intense, incredibly well-rounded welterweight world champion has landed on Ethan Fritchie's doorstep in his debut in the Art Wars Super Series here at Sin City. Fritchie knows he's in a match. And Jeff Hale may have just turned a significant corner. The experience of Hale will tell him that. I want you to walk back on your tricep, okay? That fish move right there, when you pull back like that against him, you need to walk on your tricep, you lay down on the and pull straight back, okay? You have him in position, he's completely out of his press. You need to rock back on that thing, okay? Lean back and his hand's gonna open right up, all right? Don't get stuck in that freaking hook on his side of the table anymore. You tell him, just like he's telling everybody else, I'm waiting on you, boy. You have Match. I know. All right? Yeah, yeah. Make this your time. Yeah. Hey, guys, back there. Donald Wood advising Fritchie not to be beaten. Not to fall victim to the mental games, the psychological warfare inflicted. And a man who describes himself as the soul jacker, the devil, the hail raiser, Jeff Hale. He's wrist, wrist, wrist. Yeah, yeah. I'm on that. His wrist, too. Both of you. Such Don't a complete move there. athlete, Don't the move. Hellraiser. Go! Massive drive lands in the hook again. Okay. Fritchie's world. Hit it. Ladies first, baby. Ladies first. Ladies first. Go, baby. Hit it. I want to feel the power. I want to feel the power, baby. Get it tight there. Rotate out. Win. That's the restart. Who's on the running foul? Who's on a running foul? He was on a running foul. I was? Yeah. Back of the foul. Where? Back of the pad? Look at me. On the pin. No, no. For, you understand what I'm saying? You gotta change it. Straight back in. Direction. It's, it's bogus. Ale unhappy with the call, but he was on the running foul. Oh, he needs climbing already. Fired up young athlete, this man is. Surely nope. one of the most complete arm wrestlers we've ever seen on the Super Series. Both of you. Wrist disconsolate, concerned. Look, Shoulders. Ethan Fritchie, the game that he's rocked. Wrist. Be careful that he keeps 
Lost his head. The Hellraiser. He grips. Famous for having all elements of the game covered. Not only is he an excellent technician, this man left elbow, left is a psychological elbow. cerebral puller. He will use every angle that. to defeat an opponent. And inside we go. Left elbow. Drag it to your left elbow. Winner. Comeback time, baby. It's comeback time. Look at that on the replay. We hit the hook early. Fritchie shaking visibly in his attempts to hold off the drive from the Hellraiser, but Jeff Hale would not be stopped. And he drove to the bat. His roar to the crowd. Comeback time. It's on in Vegas. Look at me. You just shove with your chest cross when you set that you're gonna hit see this elbow when it falls you're gonna pull back this way you're not gonna hit sideways that's where he wants you to go yeah 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 if you take him here what's he got nothing yeah 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 you're going right into his power all right okay guys we head into round four Ethan Fritchie, his first time in six round format here at the MGM Grand. He's blowing hard. You can hear the young man breathing heavily. He's causing me to carve in. Will endurance be the difference here at the top of the MGM? Shoulder, Ethan. A little bit of carve off there, please. Don't move there. Go! Left elbow, back. He's got nothing left, baby. The demons inside are coming out, and you can't stop me now, baby. I'm on fire! It's 2-2, two, two, and the Hellraiser smells blood in the water, announcing to the fans here at the top of the MGM Grand, the demons are coming out, and you can't stop me now. Okay, you can touch me he's there. Done. He's over. Yeah, he's done. He's shattered, baby. 2-2, two, two. is that right? 2-2? Oh, you kind of fell out? 2-2. All right. Watch. Be careful to get some change positions on you, okay? Yeah. Hit them. Uh, his, his corner's messed up. Right? She thinks it's right there. Oh, and I have to talk real. I'm out of gas. Uh, I have nothing right, left. Uh, I'll do what you do. Go for it. <laughs> Ominous signs in the corner of Ethan Fritchie. He tells his dad, Don Fritchie, nothing. work in the corner. I Good have to top roll. I'm okay. out of gas. Turn, so. The no, young look. man aware of the fact that he's facing a complete athlete in the Hellraiser, Jeff Hale, and he must go away from his comfort zone in the alien territory of the top row, but he's landed in the hook of the Hellraiser. You see me? I'm the devil. I'm the devil in sheep's clothing. Hellraiser, Jeff Hale has started to get into cruise control, and he caught Ethan Fritchie. He looked to the camera. You could see him start to go into showboat time. We love it when the Hellraiser starts to turn on the entertainment. And this complete athlete began to talk the devil in sheep's clothing. I'll tell you what, if he is in sheep's clothing, if ever there was a place not to wear a sheepskin jacket, it's in the 100 degree heat at the top of the MGM Grand Las Vegas, Nevada. But it's all good when you're winning. And Jeff Hale has come alive in Vegas. He told us it was time for the comeback. I have nothing. Six rounds the format and a baptism of fire in Las Vegas for Ethan, the game of Fritchie. He's a young athlete. I'm sure he will adapt his style to suit the six round game. You cannot knock his enthusiasm, his tenacity and his all round ability. But the fact of the matter is, that Jeff Hale, the smaller man, the welterweight world champion, has successfully stepped to the middleweight class and shown what he's capable of doing. Too much power. Too much power. The demons inside, they'd like to kill. And here it comes. Here it comes, baby. Woo. Woo. Yeah. Go to Worlds and then do that. Look at that from the Hellraiser, Jeff Hale. 
He caught Ethan Fritchie in the hook. The young man from Kansas City was burned out in there. He had very little left, and the Hellraiser told the crowd, I don't need speed. I've got too much power. Ooh, good job, buddy. The good demons good. like to kill <laughs> here in Cold. Thank you, Don. Thank you. Victory for the Hellraiser in Vegas. <laughs> I displayed my versatility, my power, my speed, my mental strength. Oh, Nobody's been able to match my intensity, my power. I was in stepping to the plate today and showing my skills, showing my speed, showing my versatility. 